Hello, I'd like to show you my build for Base Race August. This is the adorable theme. So it's really set my artistic abilities to the maximum because this could just be a build. And I'm hoping that it gets across something about being adorable. Um, what I've attempted to do here is it's got a little bit of a backstory. It's kind of the place where if you imagine you've gone on holiday down to the Mediterranean and for some strange reason you haven't got anywhere to stay so you have to go and search around and then all of a sudden you you just find the perfect place the place where you fall in love with it and you want to come back years and years later um okay so what I've done is that now it looks a little bit big here but it's it's that's minecraft for you what it's meant to be is a cobbled street down the outside going on through a, a, a tunnel into a, a courtyard around the back and there's heavily overgrowth of um vines and um what's the, what's the stuff oh moss all over the front let me take you in let's go up here Whoop. <laughs> yeah the cobbles are not very straight at all um there's kind of the main entrance over here and a little side entrance to the place where the holiday home would would go sort of in here i think um i ought to tell you it's all very very not symmet very asymmetrical and very organically grown it's it's just there's nothing straight and organized about the whole place and it really was quite an interesting place to to build it was very different from my normal building style in that i just laid out a kind of floor plan to say where i was going to build but then i had to do so much trial and error running around changing things trying things out changing them and eventually it all looked all right and what i've ended up with is something that's really a kind of rabbit's warren inside you go in and you don't quite know what's going to be around the next corner and you could stay in it for quite a little while and still not know where all the rooms were so this is kind of a a hallway an entrance hallway um in here what we got oh it's the kitchen so cooker and fridge um oh a sink places to keep things cupboard over there Ooh, not even a skeleton in there the cupboard was bare around the back here we've got a living room oh just a fireplace uh record player couple of records in there and so you've got these these kind of high backed settles or whatever they call them in in yeah like like big wide armchair things where everyone can can sit in and enjoy the fire on those winter evenings it's not just a summertime home this one if you go up the stairs i think the first room you come to is the dining room yep here we are oh places where they would put the hot plates and you come up here to your table and all sit around you've got some views out here all the windows are these kind of shuttered type um the ones upstairs um tend to not have glass in them the ones downstairs i've put glass panes in just to stop the mobs climbing in um yeah this they got the back of the house through here um and it's yeah you've got a bedroom in there there we go and one of the guest bedrooms and i think along here you've got a single room and a bathroom and a double bedroom at the end and where it, yeah, it's difficult to know where to go next oh i think um oh if we go back down here Oh look, you've got another room through here. Ah, this is this is sort of the leisure room. Everyone can sit around and play games at the tables or something like that. Um 
Down here is the other entrance. You remember out here is the this entrance here. So we've got that one with a few places to sit and read. Um, go back across to the... Yeah, this is the, the main entrance hallway through here, if you want to. And... Oh yeah, round the back here, we've got... There's one of these strange secluded little places. I'll show you that later. I will. Um, now, where have we not gone? Oh yes, all right. No, I've been there. I told you this was like a rabbit's warren. Um, through here, yes, where the dining room was there. You can then go upstairs again. And I think this was the children's room. Oh, look, yeah. Nice, friendly chap for them to play with. Children's room. And then you go on upstairs again. What we got up here? Uh, probably the main bedroom um the parents room and um they've even got their own little ensuite bathroom through there pretty sure that must i mean I'm, i must have forgotten a room somewhere these are all of the there's so many places in here but um yes if we go back outside you see so it's all very overgrown and green and you can you can walk around the back as well you can get out of the back of the house and go this way or you can go through this this um archway into a, a courtyard there's this courtyard all around the back with a pond a bit a bit more um slimy at the bottom of that pond um and yeah, so you can you can just come up here and enjoy the views out over the countryside at the back of the house. And then I, I said there was this odd little place. There was a blacksmith who used to work here, um, but it's been preserved. The old blacksmith's shop that was in in the back of the house back in the old days. So there we go. I'll fly up and show you the house from the outside. There we go the house a mediterranean holiday home that's my build for august thank you very much for watching bye bye